what's going on guys? It's Waffles here and welcome back to another episode of Attack of the Bee Team! Uh, now, well, we have a couple things to take care of today and I'm going to jump right in. But before I do that, I have to say thank you and uh, the reason I'm uploading another one of these episodes so quickly is because, oh my god, you guys... I've just shown a lot of support in the series, and it looks like this is probably one of your favorite series on my channel right now, so we're going to knock it out because it is a ton of fun to play, and we're really making some big, awesome progressions in terms of uh, working on things, so let's just rock it out. Let's keep it rocking and going. If you guys obviously enjoy the series, make sure to hit that like button, and uh, let's jump right into this episode. So, um, unfortunately, for some reason, I guess the server reset, and I lost all my morphs, uh, which is a little sad, so we actually need to go and kill another bat, which is weird because <gasps> we're just noob little woofles um, to do that well we got to get ready to kill things and to kill things we're gonna have to get a better sword so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna upgrade our sword a little bit um, I did some reading in your comments it looks like you guys wanted me to put moss so that it would obviously regenerate don't know if that's necessary because I have a moss handle I don't know if that works um, but I'm not sure if it's completely necessary um, and then you guys also want me to put on quartz and lapis lapis for looting and quartz for sharpness now I'm definitely gonna put quartz on a, a good majority of quartz on but I was also thinking maybe a couple other things, perhaps, you know, the ability to set people on fire or uh, heals the player every time a monster is attacked. There's a lot of cool things that can be put on this sword, I think, uh, that we could talk about. Like, this is, you know, add knock. Oh, I don't really want to add knock back to it, but, you know, behead mobs. Like, that's also even better. Apparently, people say that I should get all the heads um, and just maybe line a wall with them or something like that. So, I think we're going to actually do this. So, let's, first off, let's add quartz. That's that's like our main thing to do right now, and I think I need to go into the advanced uh, forge station here and throw on a whole bunch of uh, of this stuff. I'm gonna just stack it up here. Uh, we can do it a whole bunch of times. I think we might have enough. Uh, hold on a second here. Um, okay, throw this on. Throw this on. Oh man, we are rocking through our quartz pretty crazy right now. But this has got to be super sharp. There we go. Plus 15 attack damage now. This thing is an absolute beast. What's it look like now? Oh, ho, 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 ho. oh, tell me that doesn't look badass. I love it. I love Tinker's Construct. I'm like addicted to it now. All I want to do is make Tinker stuff. My name is Tinker and I like to make things. Um, all right, let's just throw. So we're going to go, yeah, on an adventure. So going on an adventure is always a little dangerous. So let's, oh, we have an obsidian right here. You know what? Let's just get... Um, let's just get an ender pearl and like just jump right in. Let's let's go hit that real quick. Uh, we're gonna get like ultra beheading status. It's gonna be awesome. We're also just gonna take some cobblestone, uh, just to have. Always nice to have cobblestone on an adventure. No, always necessary. Uh, but let's see if we have an ender pearl because I don't even think we do. Uh, we might have to actually go find one of those as well. And uh, fill up. By the way, we're gonna fill up five buckets of lava. Um, but yeah. Oh, we have moss. Uh, ball of moss, we got two left. You know, let's go put that in our tinker's uh, chest. These things are all useless, um, so we don't really need them. Yeah, let's go. Let's go throw that into our tinker's chest. But it doesn't look like we have oh, another block of quartz. Two more blocks of quartz, which is really nice. It doesn't look like we have an ender pearl, so we're gonna have to kill an enderman. It's kind of crazy that I've never killed an enderman before. Um, awkward. Uh, so let, let's do that first. Let's just go put on. Um, do we want to put moss under this? Let's go. Let's go put a little bit more quartz just to make it a little stronger, uh, because I think we can. And we're gonna go ahead and throw this in, and then one and two. So now we're at max sharpness plus 16 attack. Uh, we also need food, by the way. Oh, we need food. Okay, okay. Here we go. Before we go on an adventure, we're gonna need to cook food on the go, which means we're gonna need a frying pan. Um, it's kind of necessary, everyone. Kind of necessary. So let's make that real quick. Uh, we could just do that pretty easy, I think. Uh, let's see here. So probably pick it. I make it out of alumite. Um, I have some alumite ingots, which I think I could just melt into later uses. So it's just a tool rod and a pan. And I think we already have the pan casting. Uh, no, we don't. We have the pan pattern. Do we have the pan? Okay, yeah, stone pan. Uh, so let's actually melt. Um, these oh no we just need gold that's what we need okay um bu -bu 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 uh, aluminum brass that'll do throw this in let's cook that up turn this into a uh, smelted stuff and then we'll go ahead and make the frying pan this might take a while though so uh, i'm gonna go ahead and probably just beep it out i can't really do a lot of work um <laughs> i can't i can't really be very efficient uh right now because i'm not a bat and that's that's kind of how it's turned into uh maybe organize some chests a little bit but other than that nothing worth 
your time on uh, on on screen. So I'll be right back in just a second, hopefully with the frying pan all set, and uh, we'll rock and roll and adventure into the deep. Oh my god, that actually worked. I, I honestly didn't even know if that would turn into uh, aluminum, but it looks like we got nine aluminum ingots worth uh, out of this. So we can just go ahead and, and plop this in here, make ourselves our casting, and then I think just uh, drain it, fill this bad boy up, turn it into another block, let that harden. Uh, can we get some light in here? It's a little it's a little dark in this corner, but boom, we got another block of aluminum brass. Throw that in here. Go ahead and release the rest of this basin, which should be about four ingots worth. Won't fill up completely, but the next time we use aluminum to make a casting, we will have leftover, and we are making ourselves an efficient little machine. Now, aren't we? Oh, it's so excited. Uh, so the same thing goes with, I only think I need one aluminum ing ingot. Uh, alumini, alum, alumite ingot uh, in here. So let's go ahead and cook... We'll just do one to start, because I don't want to cook it unless I have to. Um, and it should be only one material, so that should do it. Just one ingot worth, and that is cooking. So again, I will have to let you guys go. It's really a, a bummer. I wish I could do work, but it is a little hard to do work when um, I can't fly. Like, I can't work on my ceiling. Uh, and for the ceiling, by the way, I am going to break these down. Actually, I'll, I'll show you real quick what I wanted to do with these, uh, just to give you an idea, uh, just for the roof here. I wanted to do carpenter's block and just do like that, like a slab, and then uh, turn that into something really cool, uh, which I think will be pretty awesome. So just like this, oops, like that, and then just knock them all down, um, and then put uh, either the basalt brick or uh, or something rather that that looks kind of like that. So uh, that's that's kind of my idea for the roof. It should be pretty sweet. I take a little bit of time, but um, I'll find some time to do it for sure. And uh, yeah, so that's that's my idea with that. Let's just check on the alumite uh, if it's not done. Okay, so it's only halfway, so I'll be right back in just a second, guys, and uh, thank you for being so patient. Snuggles. Mm -hmm. May we blessed be he, thine holy pink stuff. Burn it be he in the basin of life. Let us let you fall from the faucet and fill the hole with glory. Mmm, -hmm. pan. <laughs> Oh my god, 10 out of 10 on the creepiness scale. So there we go, we got our alumite pan, we are good to go. Now we need just a little bit of a road, uh, which, oh, we can actually, material cost, <gasps> we should have cooked two alumite. But we can just make that with um, this bad boy. By the way, I, I do apologize, I, I done diddly derped and uh, made an error. Um, the mossy, gotta still put the, the, the mossy on my, on my sword because the slime just adds durability while the moss actually makes it last longer. So I derped, I derped, I derped, I apologize. We put it on, we're all good, we're all mossed up. We are part tree. This is see what I, that's what I was talking about at the beginning of my, my season here. I was like, I wanna be part tree, we're just gonna put moth on everything, we're gonna have a moth pot, it's gonna be amazing. Um, so yeah, to make this frying pun, uh, we first need to make, how do you make a this thing again? Uh, just tool rod casting and then bam. Uh, bam. So just like that. Oh, darn it. Like that. Hmm. I'm trying to remember how to do this thing real quick. I derped. I derped. I could, because you can't melt these things. So you actually have to make them. I just, I literally just did it for my sword and I'm derping really hard right now. So I apologize. Oh, right, 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 right. Um, no, not right, right, right. I, I do totally forget. Right, I'll be right back just to figure this out. This is silly. I'm being silly. I'm being a silly belly. Um, yeah, I'm being a silly belly. I'm being a silly belly. Nothing works. Nothing works. I'm doing this wrong. Oh no! Okay, please don't don't hurt me. I, I tool rod pattern. I knew that. I, I knew that. Don't <laughs> don't hurt me, please. <laughs> yeah. So uh, I derped. Um, so we got the tool slime rod and we got our alumite pan <gasps> and we have a pan. Now what do we what do we do? How do we reinforce a pan? Like what? Like what? We I guess we put moss on it, but like maybe maybe put some some fiery stuff on it. Like what what is what does one do on to a pan to make it cook faster? Uh, if it does cook, I think you like shift right click to place it down and then you could cook things. <gasps> yes, yes. And then you just break it, and then pick it back up. We have a frying pan! Um, so I don't think we have blaze powder to throw on this thing, so... We could make mossy cobblestone with our chisel. A chisel? Uh, if this even... No, we need a bucket of water. 
Uh, we need a bucket of water. Oh no, we got rid of all of our water and we're not a bass. We can't fly around to do things. <gasps> okay, 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 okay. We're not gonna enchant or do- Oh, we bucket of water. Ha ha! I knew I had you in my booty. Um, but I don't think this is even gonna be enough to make enough, uh, mossy cobblestone. We need one more mossy cobblestone, which means we need one more bucket of water. Can we get a bucket of water? Oh, 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 oh. oh woofles, 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 you sneaky son of a gun. You had what it takes to be a gangster. A straight up G. You had your extra water buckets ready and available. Good for you. Um, man with a plan. All right. So here we go. Uh, more mossy cobblestone, mossy stone. We're going to make some more moss. Because we're getting hungry, guys. We're, we're going to go get some food. We got to go throw it on that on that frying pan. We got to eat that. We got to eat that good. Um, okay. So slime shard, uh, enhancement table, frying pan, moss. Auto repair. Good for you. Oh, look at us go. We actually have like all these cool things. I love it. Okay. Um, now, the big question. How in the world do we get down from here? Because I'm not a bat. And I can't fly. So, how do we do this? Uh. Uh. uh oh. Okay. Ah, ow. There's a skeleton. Must be careful. Young Padawan, he will start to snipe us. Oh, server lag, not now. Okay, do we have this? Look, let's honestly, this is gonna be crazy. Ah, uh, die! Whoa, that swing is slow. Okay, so now uh, we're now a skeleton. Let's change back before we light on fire and actually die. Um, okay, so food is our prime objective, and we can't fly around anywhere, which is terrible. Um, so, <gasps> zombies. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, get more! Oh no 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 no! Sun 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 sun! Turn back into waffles. Okay, okay. All right, all right. Food, food, food. We can't sprint. We can't do anything. That is not a pig. What is that? That's a tree. How dare you, Iris? Hmm. All right. Um. Block leaves things. It's easier to find food when you're a bat. It's easier to find food when you're a bat. Um, okay, well, we are kind of starving. Maybe we can head over to B-Dub's place and try and grab us some food. Um, that might be a good call. Hopefully he doesn't mind. No one tell him, okay? No one tell the poor old b -dubs. Actually, I, I blame him for losing my morphs. Apparently, that's what I need to do. I asked everyone, I'm like, I lost all my morphs. Like, blame b -dubs. So, you know what? You deserve this, this thief. This thievery that is about to plague your, your spawn here. I will, I will enjoy taking your stuff from your place, because if I was a bat, I wouldn't have this issue. Let's go. All right. Um, unless we can find, like, a raspberry bush or something. That'd be really nice. Let me hijack his, hijack his boat. Okay. Um, food. Let's see here. All right, B-dubs, where do you keep your nutrition, my friend? Where do you keep your nutrition? Maybe this chest? We lost our morphs! Oh, ho, ho. what do I do with this? What do I do with this, Mr. Bungeons? I don't know what to do with this. Ah! No! No! Oh! 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 I can fly! He almost killed me, Pungents. You crazy man. You're a crazy man, Pungents. You almost eliminated me. Oh, there's a chest. Well, I don't know where his food is, and this is getting uh, this is getting dangerous. I don't think I can enter this place as a wasp. Okay, Ender backpack. Okay, yeah, get get, get out of here. Uh, food? Huh? Don't mind if I do. Look at look at his kitchen. It's so nice. Wow, what a what a pro. Good job, B Dubs. This is a nice kitchen. Don't mind, you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna take a load off. I'm just gonna hang out for a bit, you know. Just um, just hang out and and enjoy your wonderful house and pretend that this is mine for just a minute. I'm gonna close my eyes while my health regenerates and pretend that I was able to create such a cute little home with my monocle and little cat in the hat, my little my little diamond booties. My little diamond booties looking so cute. <laughs> Uh, this really is a nice place, and apparently teleportation to the top of the ceiling. That's uh, that's a good little feature you got there. All right, so uh, how do we uh, set to save again? So I think we go like 
this and then we go like uh nope uh how do we do this not right click not left click that turns us into it um there is a button that we need to do to set it to our special uh favorites i think it's maybe just this button yep there we go okay cool I kind of like this better than a bat. Look how fast we are. Oh, look at our little booty. Oh my god, it's so cute. Oh my god. I love it so much more than a bat. I feel so much more accomplished. And now I feel scary too, going into battle like a like a scary, scary beast. We actually don't have to go down into the deep dungeons of the desires to kill ourselves a bat. Which is kind of nice. And I, I feel kind of bad for taking that. Maybe I can, like, leave something. But the thing is, I don't really have anything for anyone to take. Because I'm kind of a noob. Uh, I wish I did. Oh, I wish I did. But uh, hopefully at some point I can I can pay. I can repay the, the gloriousness that was that save. Even though it did almost kill me there. Uh, but yeah, we are. All we have is a heart in our freezer. Hopefully no one comes in and looks at my place. And I don't have anyone over recently. Because if they open up the fridge and they find a heart, they might start asking questions about my intentions. So uh, we gotta be we got to be careful about that. So... Anyways, we still do have to do a little bit of a mining trip. I need to find a whole bunch of stuff, but I think we can actually put that on hold and do some other things. Uh, maybe work on this area here, maybe finish up the dining room um, and do some cool things. And I have maybe an idea of something that I can do. So I'll be right back in just a second and we'll rock and roll now that we can fly, baby. Okay, so welcome back, everybody. And uh, upon further review, I think I've actually found something cool that is, oh, ho, 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 ho. How you doing, buddy? How are you doing? We'll turn back into a wasp. It's really dark here. It's probably not a good thing. Uh, let's light this place up. I mean, like a red, I mean, like a lighting fixture. I fought the darkness hard. All right, so um, yeah, we are going. We, I mean, at least I have been having a lot of issues with luggage. So we're gonna use the open blocks mod to create this cool little luggage dude that I've heard about, and he is bad. I just can't wait to try them out. Uh, we're gonna make actually two of them just because we can. And uh, God, we look, look, look at this. Look at this issue with our inventory. Just the absolute worst. Oh, um, boom, boom. I actually had a little bit of issues with uh, restarting the server, uh, or at least my packs. So I gotta do all these bats. So that's uh, that. They're right there. That's the texture pack I use. How to duty. Um, I know we have tons of sticks somewhere. Okay, cool. So simply uh, diamond on top. Chest in the middle, the sticks all around, we got ourselves a party. Uh, and this little guy right here, oh man, look at this cutie. So I don't really know how he works exactly, but I think you just place him down. And he like picks things up. Um. <laughs> oh my god, that's so cute. Okay, 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 buddy, we're gonna have fun. Ready? Oop, oop, oop. Follow the trail of cookies. Follow the trail of cookies. Oh, he's such a cute little pet. Come on, come on, come on, eat, 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 eat. Oh, aren't you cute? Aren't you cute? Okay, okay, okay. And then I think if we right-click him, we can see uh, into his body. Um, and then if we shift right-click him, he just is breakable and popped into my inventory. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, so we got our cute little luggage dude. What are we going to call him? And what are we gonna call him? That's that's the big thing right now. And this little guy needs a name. Um, Wilbert, the Wanderer. <laughs> Wilbert, the Wizard. Wilbert, the Wizard. Awesome. We got Wilbert, the Wizard, with us. Yay! Okay, wait. I just want to see real quick. If I just release him, Wilbert, the Wizard. Yo, you didn't, girl. You're so fabulous. We're both the wizard. I love you. I love you, man. We're gonna be we're gonna be the best friends ever. I promise. I promise. Um, okay, so we do have this, but we're still having all these issues with our inventory. So we can go ahead and make ourselves backpacks, um, ender backpacks, as well as other backpacks. Uh, like what are these red backpacks? These are really cool. Woven cloth string. Okay. Um, I'd like to try out spear of the huntsman. Okay, apparently it can be used as fuel. Uh, that's good to know. Um, so let's make ourselves a cool backpack. These little satchels, because I've never actually tried. I know these. Um, I've, I've used these before in Hexit, but I've never seen the Project Red Exploration backpack. So let's get one of these uh, rock and roll. So the woven cloth, stick, and string. Now, I do believe we have a decent amount of string. Mm, by decent amount, I need an okay amount, but we can make a whole bunch of woven cloths with it. Um, We'll just, we'll make five. Um, is that even enough? We're going to need, oh man, we're going to need eight. 
Oh, string hunting. Um, I think we don't have any string. Uh, I remember I went to that abandoned mine shaft. I don't know where it is. It's not on. I didn't set the marker to it. It is somewhere. Um, but I don't think we're going to be able to. And you can't break wool into string. Unless I think we have like a pulverizer. And even then, I don't even know if that works. Um, yeah, so string can make a lot of things, but we would need something to make string. A uh, cotton farm would be really great. A wool gin. Oh, iron coil. Okay, okay, now we're talking. A draw plate. Block of diamond panel from forged micro blocks. Um, eh, okay, forged micro blocks. Oh, this is getting complicated. And this is why we love this, because... All of a sudden, it starts getting really complicated. I think we need a saw to make these. Um, let's make that anyways. Uh, so we got a saw. Diamond, f so this is forged uh, micro blocks. So we need just stone sticks, uh, advanced genetics. Okay, so that, that definitely looks advanced, like some advanced genetics right there, man. A um, uh, diamond, which we have. Uh, let's, just, let's just bring this up here. Okay, so what is it? It's a diamond, it's three sticks, and then, oops, no it's not. It's three sticks, like this, and then like that. We have ourselves a saw. All right, so now that we have ourselves a saw, I'm assuming we need to make ourselves, and this is all just straight out of assumption here, uh, a diamond block. Um, okay, so now that we have this diamond block, we can get rid of the sign. And then we can, I think, I've, I've honestly never seen this, but I'm assuming you just put this in here and like this. Okay, so that's not how it works. Um, oh, it is, a diamond slab, okay. Um, is that what we want? Let's just hold up right here. Okay, 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 okay. Um, M249 saw. I want you, what? What are you doing here? Okay, uh, so we wanted to make a wool discombobulator. So string, string, um, wool gin, iron coil, draw plate. Draw plate. Okay. Uh, block of diamond panel. Block of diamond panel. Block of diamond panel. So, how do we make a diamond panel? Uh, let's let's break this up. Let's break this up. Just like this. Uh, oh, we can actually get a decent amount. Okay. And bring it back in. Diamond panel. Uh, all right. Sweet. So, now we have these diamond panels. Look at this. Inventory issues, guys. Inventory issues. Um, and now what we need is, um, what else can we make with block of diamond panel, actually? Uh, now that we're on that, uh, so, oh, it, it, does, it doesn't show you, unfortunately. Okay, so, uh, wool gin is just this uh, da, 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 iron coil draw plate, so block of iron post. No, iron posts. We are going to have to find some iron, unfortunately. Okay, so I'm going to go a little bit of mining just by myself real quick just to get this because this is how Minecraft works when it's modded. It just It's a crazy barrage of this and then that and then that and then this. So we're going to go ahead and clear out our inventory of all this stuff. So blocks go in here. Um, we got Wilbert the Wizard with us. And we're going to go put, uh, we're going to keep this on us. We're going to put our iron in here, our diamond in here. We're going to put our iron sawmill um, and our Tinker's Construct. I guess we'll throw in the Tinker's Construct chest over here. Why not? Um, put that in this bad boy here as well as all the rest of this stuff as well. Bang, 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 bada, bang, bang, bang. Okay, we'll keep this. We'll get our lava as well and... Um, we should, be, we should be relatively good to go. Okay, so I'm going to do a little bit of mining by myself. Don't mind me. And I'll be right back in just a second with hopefully some iron. Um, that would be the best case scenario. And uh, maybe with something else. So, see you guys in just a second. All right, well, this really, really is a job for Wilbert the Wizard. Uh, our inventory is absolutely jam-packed. So, we're going to bring him along with us and uh, just start my Ow! Woo! Uh, just mine, mine and everything. I mean, like, there is so much stuff. I found this great, great cave. Uh, I'll show you where it is on the map. It's literally just a little bit south um, of, of my of my base, southwest. And it just hasn't been touched. There's tons and tons of good stuff. We got uh, we got the wizard just hanging, just grabbing everything up, just enjoying it. Yum, yum, yum. Uh, and we are just, oh, look at this. We are finding tons and tons of cool stuff right now. Um, I've gotten, let's just take a quick look. I've gotten ruby. I've gotten uh, some sapphire. I've almost gotten a stack of lapis lazuli. 
Uh, I've gotten some diamond, tons of iron, and I haven't even like scratched the surface of what this place has to offer. I was kind of talking off to the side of my mic there. I apologize. Uh, look at this wizard just jumping around, grabbing stuff up. What a champion. Um, yeah, he's going to slurp all this stuff up. I should also do so as well as I uh, have some open inventory space, uh, which is not going to last long, however. And I mean, this, this cave is literally going to give me enough stuff to pretty much survive uh, and do anything I want, probably for the next like 10 episodes, because I'm going to show you how big it is in scale and in terms of what we got going on here. We gotta make more wizards, by the way. We're gonna have like a couple wizards. A couple chest guys. It'd be really cool to have like six of them just running around grabbing up all my stuff. I'd never have to pick anything up ever again. So yeah, wow. Um, I'm excited. Uh, got all this stuff. How much marble do we have? Almost three stacks right now, um, which is super exciting. I'm actually gonna leave just to see. Cause I'm just gonna get three stacks of marble that should be a decent amount for now. Um, and it, actually more because this guy, he's, he's got a stack too. So we're pretty much at four stacks of, of marble as well as a whole bunch of, look at him go. What an absolute monster MVP right here. Wow. Uh, here, grab that up too, if you want. And, uh, that's going to be it for us, at least on this front. Now the question is, how does he, uh, follow me? Does he just teleport to me as if like he was a wolf or something? Uh, we're about to find out cause that's my big question. How does he get to me? If he can't. Oh, yeah, he does teleport. Awesome. So I never even have to worry about him. I love it. I love it. I love it. So, um, so check this out. We got the running water. Uh, we come down here and look at this place. Just tons and tons and tons of stuff. Uh, iron, gold, diamonds, and there's all these little segments that break out, and it's just, it's insane. There is infinite, infinite stuff that we can, that we can get out of this place. It's, it's unreal. So, uh, we're going to fill up completely and I'll, I'll see you guys back at the, at the main hub, the main base, and we'll, uh, we'll finish up what we had going on and, uh, and the episode there. So I'll see you guys sit tight and I'll be right back with our wizardry full. Just before we head back to the base, I just wanted to take a moment and just enjoy Minecraft for a second. Like, look at that. We got the wizard to our right. And don't we? Dark, dark, deep dungeons ahead caves and the ores behind us oh joy so much fun look how pretty this is diamonds all the good stuff so <sighs> the running running water raging down in here the diamonds all over the place got our little friend keeping his company one of those moments where you just go well, I really enjoy this game I'll see you guys in a second we're on our way back and I actually decided to uh, have a little bit of a cookout um, we are hungry and we got some stuff to cook, so might as well cook it. And uh, let's get this thing rocking and rolling, if this even works. But look at this. Wow. Howdy. <laughs> We're in a good mood. We're having a cookout. That's like the best thing ever. Um, trying to figure out how this thing works exactly, but it looks like it is cooking up here. Heating up. There we go. Heat, 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 heat. That's what we like. If we had any coal, that'd probably be better. But, uh, but hey. Actually, I wonder if Wilbert the Wizard has any coal in him. He probably does, actually. Let's uh, place him down. Doesn't look like we can place him on that. Oops, sun shaders. Yep, that would do it. Uh, oh, unfortunately not. But yeah, this should be uh, heating up. Heating up, heating up. I want to have my cookout. Give me my cookout frying pan. Give me my cookout. Oh, that looks like an arrow. It's cooking up. It's cooking up. Let's throw this in there. Let's throw uh, some slime shards in there. We're going to... Oh, man, this is... A, a, a chicken pork chop slam shard delight. Uh, oh, look at that. So we got uh, some cooked stuff ready to go. That's that's a nice cookout. I uh, hope you guys enjoy the little cookout time. That's That makes me happy. <gasps> oh, God. I was like, oh, my tank is construct. Where'd it go? Um, all right, let's pick up that, uh, that Betty. We need you, Betty. I need you in my life, Betty. All right, let's go. Uh, back to our base up, up in the sky. Let's go. And we got a whole bunch of, of stuff now. Uh, lots and lots of good things. Uh, gonna have to cook through all of this iron, which is uh, going to be probably a good amount of time, I'll be honest. it's uh, <laughs> We got a lot of stuff to cook. Two stacks at least uh, to get rocking and rolling here. So we're gonna have to fill up these furnaces with all the coal we have. Um, get them rocking and rolling. And I think Wilbert actually probably has uh, more iron on him. Another three stacks of iron. That's what we're working with right now, everybody. Three stacks of iron. Oh, baby. So I'm going to let that cook, um, and I think that's uh, going to be pretty much it for this episode. Um, I think I would like to do a little bit more work, um, maybe make one more thing, but I don't know if I have the time. Actually, 
I do have something that I wanted to make a while ago that I just haven't had the time to do on camera. So we'll do that right now while this stuff cooks. And uh, in the next episode, we'll have all the iron necessary to make that uh, the wool the wool gin because we do need these blocks of block of iron posts, which I feel like is going to be a little bit more difficult to make. Maybe, uh, you know, we can actually try really quick. If we take a, a diamond panel and then uh, put a saw to it. We get a diamond cover, in which case we get, mmm, that's the thing. Diamond cover is great and all, we need that post. So how do we make a post? Uh, forged micro blocks. Uh, we don't, if we don't want to saw, okay, what other, what other diamond materials can we make for forged micro blocks? Um, it looks like it's just the diamond saw. So how do we make these brick posts without looking up online? That's what I want to know. Um, yeah, just these different types of saws. So there is a different way to do it. Um, ah, diamond strip. Okay, that's from the cover, but diamond panel. And we guess we got to go to panel, and then panel is to post. Okay. See, guys, we can figure things out by ourselves. We're big boys now. Uh, and then we actually might even be able to make this pretty quickly then. Um, so I don't have to do the thing that I wanted to do on camera quite yet, but that'll that'll come in time. All right, so we want to do uh, on the top first for iron slab. Um, okay, and then on the left side for iron no um, iron panel, and then after the iron panel, put the iron panel in, and then we get our iron post. And we need four of those. Ho 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 ho! Hot and spicy, yeah boy. All right, so a uh, wool. What's that? Wool gin. Um, remind me from the dude from Bleach. Gin. Uh, so draw plate. So we got the iron posts and a diamond panel in the middle. Uh, diamond panel. Just one of them is necessary, but I guess we take all five of them, seven of them, and then a boom, 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 and we got ourselves a draw plate, and we take this. And we go like this, and we got ourselves an iron, whatever we should call it, iron coil. Oh boy, ooh, the draw plate actually is not a one-time use. That's uh, that's exciting. I want to see what else is necessary for, uh, what else requires a draw plate here. You can get a copper coil um, and a golden coil. Okay, so it's just essentially to make coils. And then these coils are used to make, uh, so copper coil are used to make motors. Wood gin, uh, and the gold coil, we're not sure, but necessary for motors, okay, which is a part of Project Red. Cool, cool, cool. So we're getting somewhere. That's that's some that's some nice stuff that we're, we're getting. Uh, we're just going to throw this stuff in here. Um, go ahead and get rid of some of this useless stuff that we have in our inventory just to make some room. And uh, rock and roll real soon. Ruby, we can get rid of these fossils out of this, uh, out of this chest here. Cool. Um, that should be good. Okay, got all this lapis lazuli as well. Gonna make those actually into blocks. Let's do that right now, real quick. Boom, boom, boom. And then a uh, boom, boom, boom. Oh, one more lapis lazuli would have been it. And then we wanna put that on our, put that on our, both our pickaxe and our sword. But I think I'd rather put it on our pickaxe. If we have to add another slot for modifications, we could do that. Notice how hard I went on my pickaxe, by the way. Like, literally broke it almost. Um, Okay, so now that we have this iron coal, we wanted to put sticks, I believe, on all sides. Um, and sticks, I know I have somewhere. I always have sticks. Well, no, those are Tinker Construct. I know I have sticks somewhere. Come on, come on, come on. All right, well, we can make them. Not the biggest deal. In fact, we have what is necessary to make them right here. Let's go ahead and just make a whole bunch. And I believe it's this off the top of my memory. Obviously, my memory is bad. Uh, like, I don't even know what I'm doing right here. Uh, okay, so... Oh, that's what it is. Okay, awesome. Uh, dip, dip, and... Dip. Okay, so we got a wood, uh, wool gin now. And now that we have this wool gin, I honestly forget what this was to do originally. I know it was to get string, but string for what? Uh, that's the... Wow, that really hurt it. Okay, that's fine, though. So what did we want string for again? Oh, man, I can't even remember. String was for, we were making, wasn't the cloth. Um, I totally forget what we were, what we needed string for. I'm not going to lie. I'm totally just blanking 100%. 
cool things you could. I mean, I don't mind looking. These are all really cool things to make with string here. Um, whoa, sensor glasses, Galacticraft core, cool. Needle gun. Uh, these are all really awesome things that I'm really excited to make. But what did I need string for? Why can I not remember such a delicate point? I need to know. I need to know. Um, was it? Oh, I remember, I remember, I remember. Backpacks. Oh my god. All of this for backpacks. Okay. So, we just do the woven cloth, which is uh, all that around. Oh my god. The amount of time and effort being put into this for just woven cloth. Okay, do we have any roses? Oh, we have a rose. Can we make that into rose red? Awesome. And then we're going to put um, these bad boys all around and get ourselves a little satchel. A little red backpack, isn't that cute? And we'll put all of our tools in it and lava buckets and stuff. Um, that's so exciting. Okay, cool. So we have a cute little red backpack. Um, I wonder if we can actually uh, put that on. We can't. Hmm. Okay, oops. Um, it's a little unfortunate. A little unfortunate. Okay, cool. Well, anyways, I think that's going to be it for this episode, guys. We have all of our iron cooking. We got a lot of stuff getting uh, getting rocking and rolling. I think for the next episode, we're probably going to want to actually figure out how to make an induction smelter and actually start really cooking stuff because we have all this, uh, all these things to cook and also need better storage. So that's that's on the docket. That's the to-do list is better storage um, and as well as um, better storage and better furnaces because we're going to need that. Now that we can fly, we can also finish up uh, cleaning this entire area because we have the uh, the blocks necessary. We're going to need a little bit more basalt, but I'll probably do that off camera and uh, make a better pickaxe. We got a, a better axe. We got a lot to do, and hopefully we'll uh, get another episode out as fast as possible for you guys. Uh, as always, if you guys want episodes, make sure to hit that like button. Let's know that you guys love it, but it seems like you guys have been just flipping just enjoying the series so much and it's really really exciting so either way that's the episode i'll see you guys later take care and don't forget stay hot and spicy bye everyone